views from the space station are spectacular. When there are big weather events happening like hurricanes or wildfires, the astronauts aboard the International Space Station have the best view of them. And recently I had the chance to talk to them about life on the ISS and what happens when space dust and debris happens to hit their window. You know, we do have some chips in the windows from small debris that's actually made an impact. And so when they design the windows and all of station, it's really designed with protection in mind. It speaks to the fact that we're in a, an environment here that has lots of hazards, uh, but we do the best we can to mitigate it with the design we have of our space station. Okay, to talk more about the pictures, you guys often take these phenomenal pictures of hurricanes from space or, you know, the California wildfires. Are you aware of what you're actually taking pictures of? And also, are you able to give us any help and any new information from your perspective? Well, I would say sometimes we're aware of it, sometimes we're not. If there's something big happening like the, the, the um, horrific uh, fires in Canada, the ground will let us know and alert us uh, to grab pictures. Let's just talk about some of the basics for people watching of how many times you guys circle the Earth, you know, in a day and how fast you're moving. So we're going around the planet every 90 minutes. That means we have 16 orbits per day. That comes out to 17,500 miles an hour or about five miles a second. You have to be really skilled, actually, for some of the close in shots to be able to track and to get those photographs. So what is the favorite thing you have been able to see from the International Space Station in your time up there? Everything is incredible. I've loved seeing the aurora, uh, both the uh, aurora borealis and australis as well, which has been really bright during this uh, expedition 46 and 47. Uh, I love seeing thunderstorms at night as well. It's really spectacular. And actually, in fact, it almost looks as if uh, one lightning strike triggers a whole series of further lightning strikes, and they all go off together, which is really spectacular. Tim, Tim and Jeff, thank you so much. I have to say this is a real treat for me. I went to space camp twice as a kid, so I am in very much in to this and you've just you've made my like year so thank you so much and uh, can't wait to talk to you guys again thank you it's been great talking with you